What is going on? I'm Bayus Hash here, 12 Gaming, back with another video for you guys. Today we are reacting to the top 10 kids that post, uh, rich kids that post stuff on their Snapchat. I don't know. Let's just get into it. Anyway, go subscribe to Boy Gaming, link is down in the description. Go follow me over on Twitter at Tash here, 12 Gaming. It is up on the screen right now. Anyway, let's get into it. If it would actually let me. Oh, okay, I guess we're not getting into it today. Oh, there, there we go. There's something about watching how the 1% of the world lives, but there's a fine line between being flashy oh. Okay. I just pause the thing because that's what I, that's clearly what I guess. And being just plain douchey. If this is your first time visiting us, click that red button, subscribe, and enjoy. Oh, These are 10 douchey that. things Get the rich stuff. kids of Snapchat do. Flaunt their wads of cash. What is a better way of letting the world know that you have money than to show them your huge wads of cash? Not only do the rich kids of Snapchat do this, but they have gotten creative and- Alright, so, um, number one, we're already off to a start, you know, um, rich kids that, you know, just, just put their cash all over, I mean, why not? I mean, look at all that money on the screen. Don't you just wish you had that? Okay, if I had that much, I'd be really happy. Especially at Christmas. Oh my god. That'd be lit. I'm just, I don't know. That's kind of crazy. Like, you just don't go flaunting around media like that. Obviously. I mean, just saying. If you were rich, would you do it? Let me know. And their flashy snaps. From using money for anything like a table mat, tissue paper, and even toilet paper. Oh, okay. So what you're going to do is you're going to be like, you know what? Nah, nah, nah. Regular peasant toilet paper isn't enough for me. Let me just go grab a $50 bill and put them on top of there and use that. Because... Let's not actually just use, okay, you know, let's not use the money to buy it. We're just going to use the money instead. I mean, either way, you're using the money for the same thing if you think about it, but I don't know. These rich kids have gotten a bit obnoxious when it comes to showing off their dough. We usually see behavior like this from insecure adults. Wait, 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 wait. What, we was, what was in the middle of that sandwich? I'm not going to back, I'm not going to back it up because it's too much work. But what was in the middle of that sandwich? Did, if anyone caught that, leave me know, like. At, like at me on Twitter and I get a retweet or something or follow but like if you can screenshot that and send it to me I would really want to know what that is like I'm curious now I can kids are starting film. young these days destroying pricey goods what's an iPhone or an iPad to someone who just can purchase a new one at a whim I know that's great right Another. the rich kids of that man's a savage that's a good one right <gasps> Okay, I wasn't actually gonna smash my mice. That would probably be a bad thing, even though you couldn't see it. I was gonna take my computer mice and smash it, but um, can need that for the video, so uh, let's not do that. Snapchat go through expensive gear and electronics so quickly that they're keeping Apple in business. When they get new phones, they go to great lengths to destroy their old phones for everyone on Snapchat to see. Okay, how to destroy old four S? Okay, why are you still using a four S? Yeah, I have a five S, but four S is like. You can't even buy them anymore. Like, why are you why are you destroying it? You could just like, I mean, there's things that like the malls and stuff. You just give them to and you get money for it. I mean, if you're that rich, I understand you don't want money, but you could have got more. And why are we burning dollars? That's against the law. We're burning U.S. currency. I'm sorry, I just had to say that. From burning expensive stuff they don't want anymore to not taking care of the stuff they already no, have. Okay. It's they're using an iPad as a placemat. Oh, and they're putting money in the trash can. I want to be next to that guy while he's throwing or a girl, whoever. Uh, when he, when I'm that, like, I'm gonna sit right next to that person when they, when they leave while they're trying to throw money in the trash can. I'm gonna go right over that trash can and take that money. Like, dang, these people are stupid. Yeah, you know, let me just throw money in the trash can where other people can see me and they could just run over and get it. Seems like it's about the time their parents pull the cord on these kids. Presents from mom and dad. When someone gets good grades, they're usually given a nice pat on the back. But when a rich kid gets good grades, they're rewarded with cars, watches, and new phones. One kid's parents weren't sure which color iPhone their kid wanted. Oh, I'll get to get them all five, you know? <laughs> That's what I would do, right? Just get them all five. Did. So they ended up buying them all colors because why not? Another rich kid snapped a quick photo of their amazing arrangement of Rolex watches yeah, and Rolex coordinating and colored bottles from pricey Dom Perignon champagne for every passing grade, just proving that they're completely earning all these extravagant gifts. Over the top purchases. 
If there's one thing rich kids of Snapchat are oh, good at, Snapchat. it's shopping and showing off their purchases. These kids can spend $100,000 or more in one shopping trip, and they take the snaps to prove it. They buy anything from a $10,000 fountain pen to a I new was, Lambo with just I, a... I, I always wanted a $10,000 pen, because I, I always just go to the store and be like, yo, can I get a $10,000 fountain pen? Because I, I always wanted to spend $10,000 on a pen anyway, so... Oh, and I get a new Lambo. It's lit. Snap of their fingers. When you have no budget, why not buy four iPads for no, no reason? Yeah, These kids are no, given not. all the money in the world, and watching how they spend it is oddly satisfying. Making fun of the less fortunate. For some reason, these kids love to put down the other 99% wow. of the world by constantly calling them peasants. I am the king! Heaven forbid rich kids of Snapchat be subjected to public school or transportation, because they literally cannot. When they're with their friends who made it into the same exclusive private okay, school- why are they writing on their fingers? I, I know this is probably normal, but who, who, who does that? If you're rich, can't you just like, buy friends? Do you have to write friends on your fingers? I mean, I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just asking, okay? That's just my point of view. I'm sorry. Them, they usually find ways to degrade them. <laughs> From having them draw watches on their arms okay, to snapping them draw them. designer labels on their clothes. The rich kids stop at nothing to put down people who are less fortunate than them. Showing off designer goods. The rich kids of Snapchat can only have the best things life has to offer, and they make sure we all see what we are missing out on. Oh By the best things, we mean water that costs three figures and clothing that most people would have to take out a small loan to afford. Yeah. We get that they have grown accustomed to the finer things, but to show off their $5,000 shoes when a lot of people in the world don't have any is pretty douchey. Would it would say. be nice to see them donating their clothes and shoes to charity every now and then. Yeah. Why complain about their lives. Oh, there seems to be a reoccurring theme when it comes to rich kids on okay, Snapchat that, that, that proves they're like all spoiled she, brats. She they complain like about their lives constantly, oh, the from being helicopter. annoyed with their butlers to complaining about the size of their million dollar houses. They just don't know what it's really like to suffer. These rich Okay, so they don't know what it's really like to suffer. I mean, yeah, it is true. They just, they just buy what they want. I mean, considering it's almost a holiday season, they're just like, dang. Let me just buy every little thing possible that I can. I'm just going to go out and buy everything I can. Rich kids seem to be ungrateful for their very you fortunate car, lifestyles. And if they are... I'll take that car for sure. Let me know down in the comments if you would. <laughs> you hate your car, I'll take it. So unhappy, we know a ton of people who would be willing to trade spots. No regard for possessions. When it comes to taking Ooh, care of their cars, though. toys, and boats, rich kids have no regard for their possessions. One kid took a photo of his yacht sinking in the harbor, and then bragged about how amazing the party must have been. Another left a top down on their expensive car and decided it was time for a new one instead of repairing the damage. It must be hard to take care of things when you can buy a new one without even thinking twice. Ah. Cool watch, bro. If there's one thing we can't Stand about Snapchat. It's the constant need for these rich kids to show off their watches. Oh, yeah. A watch oh, for a birthday. A, a watch for an A. Savage. A watch just because. We are up to you know, here with your watch. You know, just just because I'm just gonna go out and buy you a new brand new Rolex and a brand new Porsche to drive with it. You know, that's that's, that's what I'll do. You know, I'm rich. I'm like, here you go. I'm gonna go out and buy you a brand new Rolex and a brand new Porsche just just to drive with it. But it's okay. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, yo, let me just go out and buy you a brand new Porsche and a brand new Rolex. We get it. You're rich and your watch is expensive, but we really don't care. Go back to showing the cool vacation you're on, but please refrain from getting your watch in the frame this time. Mm. Misusing expensive goods for laughs. When they aren't destroying their iPhones or iPads, rich kids are using them to get a laugh. What would you do if you ran out of paper to practice your math on? Well, right on if hand. you're a rich kid, you would just draw all over your iPad or computer. Why not? Forgot your umbrella? Don't worry, you can just use your iPad, even though it's not waterproof. A Need a good game to play at school? Why don't you and your rich friends just play a game of iPhone Jenga? Alright, so that's gonna end today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy. There's not very much left to this video. There's really no need to finish watching this. This is really stupid. Let's just play iPhone Jenga. Anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy. Please be sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Go to subscribe. Boogie. Boy, your yeah, boy gaming link is down in the description. Also, go follow me on Twitter at tashia 12 gaming I will see you guys tomorrow with another reaction videos. We will be doing this all the way up to like past Christmas, I believe. So, I hope you guys did enjoy and peace out.